right, so this is the March Ipsy bag. It's a nice floral pattern, getting us ready for the spring. And inside the bag, it comes with the card, and it says, Hello Spring. And can we just go ahead and say that this girl is on fleekness? Like, look at that. She's on fleekness. But you can go ahead and turn the card around, and it'll give you all types of information. So if you're not following Ipsy on any of the social media, you need to do that now. Alright ladies, so for my first product, I got this from my January bag, and this is Sugar Lip Scrub. And I want to go ahead and set my lips with this and get it all rubbed in, get all those scabbiness away, you know? And I love this sugar scrub, like I said, I got this in my January bag, and it's really good. Um, and the taste, guys, yes, I taste it. It's really sweet, but I wouldn't recommend you just eat it all the time. But I just prepped my lips with this and wiped it away. Then I have my NYX Liquid Suede, and this is in the color Pink Less. Now this color on me, yeah, I would say it's too bright for me. I couldn't do this color, but overall the product is really good. I would definitely go purchase this product again in the different colors that they have. They do have this on sale for $7, so it's definitely a thumbs up for me. All right, so next I have the Nude Stick Lip Plus Cheek Pencil, and this is in the color Mystic. Now, y'all, I love this color. Like, it is the most natural-looking lip balm, stick, whatever. It's very natural-looking. I really love it. This definitely gets a thumbs up from me. I love this so much. All right, so next I have the Ofra Eyeliner, and this is in the color Gringo. Now, this color, I have to show it on the back of my hand, because when I put it under my eye or try to use it as a wing liner, it really didn't show up on my skin complexion. So that's the only thing I didn't like about this pencil, so I wouldn't go get this color again, again in particular. But if they had different colors, I really like how smooth it just glided on. But as far as this color, I couldn't just rock with it. It wasn't showing up. So hopefully the other colors have more pigment to it. All right, so this is my most favorite product in the bag. This is by Global Beauty Care, and this is their Dead Sea Wash Off Mask. Now, overall, I just love masks, but this mask is designed to go ahead and clear the skin, make sure it's nice and moisturized and all that good stuff. Um, but I'm just showing you how to apply the mask and you want to leave this mask on for 15 minutes and just let it work and get into your skin. So in the meantime, you can go ahead and text your friends, you know, get some chats on, get on the phone and just gossip to all your friends and just tell how your day was going and whatsoever and all that. Or you can go ahead and get on Snapchat. And if you're not following me, my name is Shell Denise on Snapchat. So yeah. So the next thing is the 28 Remedy, and this is a balancing toner, and I love this stuff. Now, the price is a little bit pricey, um, so I don't know about getting it again, but it really does clear your skin up. I did see results in about two days by just using this little bitty tube. All right, so this is from my February uh, Ipsy bag, and this is the Skin Fix Ultra Rich Body Butter. And I use this on my face because it definitely moisturizes my face totally. Like, it's not dry after I use this stuff. A little of this goes a long way, so I definitely give this a thumbs up, and I really do love it. All right, so once again, these are the products that I got from my Ipsy bag in March. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. If so, go ahead and give us a thumbs up. Don't forget to comment down below for more videos that you would like to see. And definitely subscribe to my channel, guys. And I will see you in my next video. And don't forget to check out my January and February Ipsy bag reviews. And that's where you can get more information about these two products, guys. And I'll leave those links down below.